Hi, it is Monday the 1st of March, 9.20pm on Monday the 1st of March and it is time for today in my boo journal. <laughs> so yet again, here I am playing catch up. This week should be the end of all the things that are uh, basically getting in the way at the moment. Um, so hopefully life will get back to normal and I might be able to get some more videos out and just get on with everything. So um, let's see, I'm going back to Sunday, so Friday, fuck I can't remember what I did on Friday. Apparently I filmed, so I'm assuming I put a video out. I'm going to mark that I put a video out. There was part of me just thought, you know what, I'm just going to skip straight to the 1st of March because I can't remember what I did. I know I did that. And that was all done. So, yeah. I don't know. That was done. Okay, so let's put... I'm just going to do the very, very basics for... The remainder of the trackers because you know I haven't been at all organized Friday but um if this weekend was my um two about well, two of my children's birthdays actually my daughter turned 26 on Friday and my son turned 25 on Saturday. So I obviously wasn't able to um, um, do a video Saturday because everybody came around for dinner. And um, I didn't do one yesterday. Well, I did do one yesterday, but it wasn't a, a, a daily. It was my March setup. So by the time I'd done that, I'd been in the chair for three hours and I was done. I'd had enough. So yeah, I'll just let's see. Again, I'm not gonna mark any of that because I just really can't remember what I did. Okay, so let's change the pen. I'm just gonna sort of briefly go through it. Oh my tape failed on my on my thingy. Oh man. Stupid loopy thing. Part of me is like remove it and I did initially but now I'm like but I might want to hang it up. And it's easy to grab it by that little loopy thing. You know. I don't really want to be sat here doing this now because I've done a weekly setup for you. So, um, you know, I ache to be honest with you guys, you know. Yeah, it was a good day on Saturday, which was Kelly's birthday. The only bummer of it was, was I slept crappily the night before, you know? Yeah, it literally was half past four before I fell asleep. It's insane. And then I was up at half past eight because I had a cake to make and I wanted a vacuum and you know the 3001 things that I wanted to do to make birthday special and I actually felt okay when I woke up even though I'd had this really really bad night I felt really really okay it was just it was just one thing after another and the cat crapped upstairs and I couldn't find out where she'd crapped even you know 
even though she'd been out, like before I'd gone to bed, yeah, the I was just dozing off, or well, I just dozed off, and the smell woke me. And I was like, Jesus fucking Christ, you know? And it felt for a minute like she'd shat on my pillow next to me. So I got up and I went snooping around the house with a torch because I said I didn't want to wake Daryl up. I find hide nor hair of this bloody pile of poo. Wondered if maybe the dog had farted because she needed to go outside. So hauled her all the way downstairs, let her up. She actually did poop as well, which was the funny thing. And then, um, you know, went back upstairs. Still couldn't trace this smell of poo in the end. I was just like, well, I'm just going to put it until tomorrow, you know. And um, finally fell asleep. I had a nightmare. And I woke up a couple of hours later. And I had a migraine coming. By the time I actually went to sleep, it's like, for fuck's sake, you know. Okay, so uh, this is for Sunday. And then we are on to today. Yay! Past February, February is out of the way. All right. So yesterday, I didn't do very much yesterday. I was so tired. I didn't wear any teeth, my day face grind. Didn't wear any makeup. Took an antihistamine. I did some work on my dreads. I posted to Instagram. I filmed, edited, and uploaded. And I marked down that I've I uploaded it on Sunday. You guys just don't see it until like Monday morning, but it is actually uploaded and ready to go before I go to bed. Occasionally, I may have to come down and just go add end screen. Because end screen you can't actually add until it's finished processing, which is a pain in the ass. But yeah, that's pretty much it. Uh, I didn't have any caffeine yesterday. Booze. More chips come to think of it. Hey fucking hell, did I get almost a full house? If I'd worn makeup yesterday, that would have been a full house. Did his AM teeth and made his bed. He had a jippy tummy yesterday. So it was a little bit lesser because of Daryl's funny tummy. But I got a lot done, you know. Well, I got a lot done in regards to my journal. <laughs> I haven't touched my junk journal in about two weeks and it's bugging me because. I know there's going to be things that I'm going to forget to put in there. So I think my junk journal is going to end up being very, very much in the throes of a junk journal in that um, it's probably not going to go in order. I'm just going to record things as and when. You know, I'll try and do them consecutively, consecutively, but I don't think it's going to happen like that. So I don't know. We'll just have to see. Right, so yesterday, <laughs> excuse me, <sighs> oh dear, yeah I went to bed early, you bloody betcha I did, 10.45 I fell asleep, and we all went to bed early, and I slept bloody great that night. Except for the fact that Daryl was in my bed. Because he heard me going upstairs. He hadn't been asleep long enough, you know. And I did 6,000. <gasps> oh, excuse me. Two hundred and fifty-four. That'll do somewhere in the middle there. Okay. I'm really pleased that I got things like I've got the lawn mowed this week and that is a big big thing for me because it's one of those jobs where it's quite a large job 
there's nobody else here that can do it and I tend to put it off because I know it's going to be a large job you know so I'm glad that I did it okay So I did loo and laundry. Didn't strip the beds because I literally did not have time. Teensy bit of tidying up in here. And I did some dishes and that's pretty much it. What? No, I did watch Smackdown. Good, so we can move those through to this week. Yay! So, if you have watched my weekly video, my weekly setups, you'll know what I've done. If you haven't, go watch it now. Go on. What I've done is I have now set up the entirety of March. All of it. Okay, I have done my cover page. I have done my trackers. My seat and step trackers. My card of the day trackers. My chores trackers. And I have set up my weeklies. All of my weeklies. Because I've been struggling this year, you've, you've, you've probably noticed that so far I have been struggling to keep up with my journal. Um, part of that is um, because I have a thing going on, a family thing going on, that um, it's not physically getting in the way, it's mentally getting in the way. So, um, you know, I've got my son staying here with me, one of my sons staying here with me, and it just, it just, it's, it's thrown off my, my equilibrium a little bit. Okay. Hopefully things will change. It's going to be bad this week. Possibly. Um, I've also got an education meeting on Friday morning, uh, Microsoft team thing, which I'm really not looking forward to. This is the first, uh, meeting I've had with the board of education since I do register Daryl from school. So I'm a bit, I'm a bit stressed, okay, this week is going to be really, really stressful, so please bear with me. I'll try and get videos out when I can. I will try and get online. I cannot guarantee Wednesday at all, all right? I can't, can't guarantee Wednesday night at all because I've got no idea what my day is going to be like, all right? But, you know, we, we bear with me on that one, all right? Just bear with me and I will do my best for you. So... Let's get going with this. So I did my AM teeth, my day face cream, and I bought makeup. I was very, really, 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 really pleased with the eye makeup I did. And my daughter was like, that looks a bit dark. But she was looking at me in the shadow. And when I turned around to the sun, she went, oh, actually, that looks really, really nice. I said, don't forget, I wear glasses as well. I'll take them off so you don't get the glare. But I was really proud of the job I did. my glasses didn't leave such a big red mark on my nose um i haven't taken my antihistamines i've done a little bit of dread work i still haven't put in my extras yet i was going to do them with her today and just didn't get around there until quite late so we didn't get up to it um i am recording in fact i have recorded edit and edited and uploaded already so i'm actually going to mark those as done which will probably could totally confuse me tomorrow i've had a little bit of caffeine i will admit but I was really, really good about it. I had chips. I haven't crafted yet. I've done that lot. Daryl did his AM teeth. Did not make his bed. We haven't done any lessons because we've been out. And he did his PM teeth. Okay. I forgot to write in the numbers. Not that it majorly matters. So I know where I am. Um, do you want today's been actually... It's been quite good fun. Daryl and I have been playing Pokemon Go. Now I know I'm about five years behind everybody else and I would never 
ordinarily play Pokemon Go because I'm not a fan of Pokemon. Um, I had to watch it so much when my older children were young that, you know, it's, it's not really my style. But um, Daryl is currently going through both Pokemon and Digimon with Kyle. And um, Matt had to say to him, there are Pokemon games you can get. And I was like, yeah, we can get one. And, and the whole idea was it would encourage him to want to go out. What I did forget was, of course, every time you find a Pokemon, you've got to fucking catch it. It's not just a case of tapping on the fucking thing. You've got to throw Pokemon balls at it until you've caught the fucking thing. And that's if it doesn't escape. Yeah, I've had, I had one that escaped about six times. Pissed me right off. And then you've got to scan things. And, and, we, and we lost all our Pokeballs within the first 20 minutes. We used them all. I didn't realise they weren't um, infinite. And then somebody, uh, and then I was told, oh, you've got to, you've got to scan it. And I was like, but I can't scan it because I'm only level seven. I'm not level 20. And then I realised you've got to flick the picture. That's what you've got to, yeah, so. But we caught Pikachu. We caught Pikachu today. So Daryl has had a fantastic day. Um, it's been a lot of fun. It's been slightly stressful because it's really, really hard to see what I'm doing when I'm holding the phone here and his head keeps sort of like, because he wants to, he wants to look as well. Um, but, you know we 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 are slowly getting the grasp of this pokemon thing now sleep last night where's the sleep i did not get a lot of sleep last night don't know why i'm so so thirsty it is just not even funny I'm really craving really cold coke, but I'm not going to go get some. I'm going to be good. Yeah. I mean, I slept, you know, when I did fall asleep, I slept through till this morning. But I feel tired. I'm tired today. But then, like I said, we've been out for a walk and then we went to visit Cali, which is an hour's drive now if I want to go and see my daughter, which, you know, I'm going to grump and complain about that on a regular basis, so get used to it. Yeah, um, so that was a drive out there, and I was driving into the sun, and I'm photosensitive, so by the time I got there, my face ached from, even though I had the sun visor down, trouble is my sun visor, when I fold it down, I'm then driving along like that, so I have to go underneath it, do you know what I mean? So my neck hurts, my eyes hurt, my face just, uh, everything aches. It's tired. This all feels tired, you know? It's 9.40, I haven't done any knitting yet today and that bugs me as well. So, um, yeah. Did you remember to pull a card for y'all this morning though? And the card we pulled is got here two people who are arguing it's uh, obviously it's car accident there in the background um, in this situation everybody thinks they're right okay or everybody thinks the other person is at fault that's two different completely different things being right or knowing the other person is at fault are two different things just because you know for a fact that the other person is at fault does not mean that you are faultless. Okay. Um, sometimes that's very, very difficult to see. You may know somebody who is one of these two people here. That means you have to be this person here. You have to be the calm voice. You have to be the voice of reason to make these people, both of these people realize that um, they might actually both be wrong and not both be right. I've put not being at fault does not mean being right. I listen to the voice of reason. Okay, I have not done any housework today, to be honest with you. I did the loo and the laundry. I did do those, uh, mainly because, you know, living with two boys, 
the loonies doing every day and yesterday Daryl had a bit of an upset tummy so yeah definitely need to do it today um, the dishes have been done I did the dishes after dinner Turn the fruit in the oven. Turn the fruit. Turn the fruit in the oven. Huh? <laughs> okay, so let's see. Kylie had her scan this morning. All is going well. The baby weighs about four pounds. That's good. She's 32 weeks now. So, um, yeah, all is progressing very, very well for her. She's just got now, just got to keep them in there as long as possible. There you go. Interested to see whether the fact knowing that my weeklies are done is going to encourage me to actually come out here and do it. You know, because that's that has been part of the problem is knowing each week that I've got to come out here and do another fucking weekly, you know? So it's going to be interesting to see whether I can keep up with it this, this month. Um if I can't, I really don't know what I'm going to do. I, I love the freedom that a bullet journal gives me, but at the moment, just the whole keeping it set up and keeping on top of it has been a bit much. It A lot of it has... Is it laziness? I don't know, because I'm getting to the evening part of the day. Like, this evening, it's now 9.45. By the time I've edited and uploaded this 25-minute video, it's going to be 10.45. I haven't had any me time. I haven't had any time sitting in front of the TV knitting on my socks which I want to be doing right now and you could say well you could do it now but I've got to edit the video that's going to take another 30 to 45 minutes so which is why a lot of the time you are getting videos that I've literally just chucked some music onto and um, chucked in the welcome to and then just uploaded it because I don't want to be sat here cutting bits out tidying it up and all that rubbish because it cut cut it's the time. It takes so much time and it's exhausting when you're doing it every single day. Okay, so please, please, please be, bear with me. I really do appreciate it. Um, we'll just have to, we'll just have to see what's going on. I don't know. There's so much happening at the moment. I really appreciate it. Okay. I'd really appreciate a thumbs up as well. That would be awesome. Um, any comments, suggestions, feedback, anything. Just chuck it down below that would be awesome every comment gets a like a love or a written response hit that icon down there in that corner and you'll be subscribed <laughs> yay is it worth it you ask yourself i don't fucking know subscribe if you want to that would be awesome but if you do subscribe hit the bell then it appears down below and you'll be notified when i upload new content <laughs> thank you so much for joining me today i really really do appreciate it have a fantastic rest of your day no matter what it is that you're doing and i'll see you next time take it easy guys bye